Investors returned to risk Monday, driving the Nasdaq to a record-closing high and Bitcoin back to the $50,000 mark in intraday trading. Helping boost sentiment, Pfizer and BioNTech's COVID-19 vaccine got full approval from U.S. regulators. Wall Street shrugged off mixed economic data, showing a third straight monthly drop in U.S. business activity in August, but a rise in home sales in July. Sanders Morris Harris Chairman George Ball says investors welcome lukewarm readings on the economy. And for now, a placid, tepid economic backdrop is very good for stock prices. That's why today is a risk on day. Uh, the economic pronouncements have been relatively disappointing. If you're an economist, uh, they've been quite pleasing if you're a stock trader. Industrials powered the Dow six tenths of a percent higher. The S&P 500 gained nine-tenths of a percent, and tech stocks propelled the Nasdaq one and a half percent higher. The headline about the approval of Pfizer's vaccine came just after the drug maker announced a $2.3 billion deal with Trillium Therapeutics. It's buying the remaining shares it doesn't already own of the cancer drug developer. Pfizer shares rose over 2 percent. Trillium shares nearly tripled. GM shares fell more than 1 percent. The automaker said it'll take a $1 billion hit to expand the recall of its Chevrolet Bolt electric vehicles due to the risk of fires from its battery pack.